get one red, but man, the XP that you get, the bonus XP that you get, we were looking at it yesterday. Without books for a normal skill, you need that you know that you're not proficient in um, and whatnot. And I don't know how true these numbers are. These are just numbers that I pulled from the interwebs. So take it with a grain of salt. Um, it was like forty or thirty-six thousand that you needed without books, and sixteen hundred or something like that with books. I was like, "Whoa, that's a discrepancy." Huge one. We are back on the move. Um, and for those that don't know, our base is always right here. <laughs> and the reason for that is it's One second, everybody. I gotta go off webcam. I'll still be in game. I gotta go webcam and mic for a call real quick. Sorry about that, everyone. <clears throat> okay. We're in the home stretch now. This becomes my road that I use almost exclusively to go everywhere. Um, this is the vehicle we're going to be using to get our mechanics up. <laughs> thing about mechanics, for those that don't know, the one of the best ways to get mechanics is if you can pop the, the hood of a vehicle, and we have the key for this one, so we can get it fixed. But no matter what your level of mechanics are, excuse me. Okay, we're good. Um, go through and just right click and uninstall. Do your best that you can do with whatever you got. So if like this, we can get, we don't install the radio. Um, yeah, I need a wrench. But go through and grab whatever you can. Uninstall it, reinstall it once per day. That's the easy, that's an easy way to get your, your mechanics up. And if you have multiple cars to do that with every day, 
you're gonna go the air mechanics is gonna go up pretty quickly uh, so yeah I highly highly advise doing that and if this thing works I can get my <laughs> I can hit my base that would have saved us if, if I would have known about the spear thing if this if this works as I'm hoping it works and we get a good chunk of XP or a decent chunk of XP per spear um, I have a lot more trees to knock down so we're gonna we're gonna let loose uh, but yeah definitely if, if you're looking to get mechanics done like I said, pull everything you can out of it and put it back together. Now, if anybody knows a way to get electrical up quickly, let me know. That one's the bane of my existence. Everything else, besides fitness and strength, fitness and strength are always going to be your toughest. You have exercises that, that will help you with those, but man, they, these take a long time to, to level up. Beyond these, the hardest one I've ever seen is electric. So if anybody has any tips. Okay, so here is home base. Well, at least the start of it. This is what it looks like. This is going to be the size of it. Each one has a color code. So, in um, each room, for the most part, has a purpose. Um, and then second floor will be cut off here. This will be the second floor. And these will have a roof that I can do things on. And then the top one. But yeah, I have plenty of branches. Let me go ahead and dump. Big build takes takes time when you're doing. Uh, you know what? We're doing. Advantages. We'll keep the knife. Only 25? Well, we only got 25 right now. Eleven. We're getting about nine per. Yes, just this. It's, you know, it's, it's Spartanish. All right, we gotta stop. Spears. That was getting us nine. 174. The quarter staff. Really? Here's our better. <clears throat> Nine's not that that great with a five times multiplier. 
We're getting nine. I don't know if that was worth it. Not terrible. We had more branches. Oh yeah, no. Uh, well. I wonder if you get more for having it with planks. This will be oh my thirsty. But it's not a bad way of doing things. We didn't eat the chili. Because we get XP for sawing as well. trees we got to knock down so this is not the end of the world to turn them into spears that's not bad although we're gonna have a lot of spears sitting around everywhere um. I wonder can I use the spears as fuel hmm I'm wondering. Can't have my books, sorry. No. have to find something to do with all those spears. So we got a lot of them. I'm sure we could probably burn them. Hey, what's up, Martin? Yeah, you missed it. Earlier today, we were at 227. Um, we've been holding at about between 90 and 120. 140. Earlier it was 140. Uh, today it's been, uh, yeah, so we had three raids today. Um, so again, a big shout out to Time of Chaos, um, and to Sapphire. Uh, Sapphire brought 162, Time of Chaos brought 52, and, uh, Unknown Host brought 28. Been a weird day. Been a weird day. Good day. Definitely a good day. Um. Weird day. We have definitely um, set records for this channel today. 
And I'm very, very thankful. Hey, actually, this is going about the... Oh, what it... No, we've had people in chat uh, pretty constantly. Um, <laughs> uh, pretty regularly today. Um, so, yeah, not too bad. It's been, it's been nice. Actually, what happened to my broken? Uh oh, it broke. Oh, that's. Oh, <laughs> I knew that was coming. <laughs> knew that was coming. <laughs> We need two duct tape. I know I got two duct tape. No, it didn't. No, people have been, like I said, people have been talking and, um, yeah, it's been, it's been going. Um, okay, so this method puts a big strain on your, on your weapons. Um, this might not be the best method. It's not bad. <laughs> How do you know Sap uh, Sapphire? I'm assuming it's a, it's a friend of yours. I don't want to, to use up all of our machete. So I think what we're going to do is go back to um, what we were doing. But I'm going to go pick some more. And I'm going to clear out the back. Which is pretty much cleared out. <coughs> um, Hammer, screwdriver, salt. Okay, let's go get some water. I still think it was quicker doing it, uh, dismantling things, but the spears is not a bad way to go about it. Um, especially if you have a lot of bladed uh, items. Um, <clears throat> it's actually not a bad way. Uh, we're just going through things a little bit too quickly, so. Uh, I'd rather do the disassemble than Let's go ahead. 
and wash myself. We don't want to catch a cold or... Okay. Like this channel, itty bitty streaming, but growing. Um, well, you're not the only VIP on this channel. Um. But. You are a VIP on this channel. I thought I heard a zombie. Somebody be attacking me at this point. I'm pretty sure. Fairly sure. So today's Thursday, so yeah, I want to be done. A few things. One in particular. I want to make sure that um, we're 100% on the walls and definitely doing the um, at least adding the second, you know, the flooring for the second floor. Uh, I've not finished this flooring for the second floor uh, by the end of the day tomorrow. It's if we can get what we need. The walls won't take too much longer to put up in place. I think we have enough screws. Obviously, we're in a forest, so wood is not an issue. That matter we're in the huge woods. This is all woods, woods, woods everywhere. So okay, again, let's make sure oh, we're gonna grab a little bit of food. Grab a lot of food, a little bit of food, and uh, Um, 
and potatoes. Uh, food we will we'll, we will get um, as we're dismantling these houses. Um, not worried about food. Water I'm always a little nervous about, but uh, food I'm not. start saving up uh, water for winter. Winter is going to be a little rough. So one of the downsides to Project Zomboy that they haven't fixed yet, but I think they're fixing in build 42, which is the next uh, edition of um, Project Zomboy, is that house that I'm building, the game doesn't recognize it per se as a house, right? So we can't ever make it like a safe house or uh, anything like that. For some reason it doesn't register it as a house in terms of safe houses and stuff like that which makes me a little nervous about the helicopter event and stuff like that but we should be okay um especially because hydro or hydrocraft allows you to build really nice walls um they're expensive which is their balance they're way expensive um But, having said that, they're fantastic. And I don't think the zombies can get over them. So... Um, you know. We'll look into that as time moves forward. But, yeah, I want to get the house done. Once the house is done, then I'm gonna we're gonna we're gonna finalize the transition from the old base to the new base because we'll have storage enough to put things where they're supposed to go um, and get organized. Once we're organized, the next step after that will be to build a solar array, uh, which I'm almost positive will give us enough power to run everything we uh, need. Uh, I've never used one before. It looks interesting. Um, so I'm very hopeful there. Because then that would mean that we don't have to worry about refueling it. Ever. So all of our fuel can go towards a vehicle of our choosing. Interesting. I did not know that. Sounds nice though. It's good when you. It, well, it's, it's exactly what I'm trying to build here, right? It's a good community of people that you know, love video games. Um, and it's nice when when you can find a community like. That. So it's good to hear that that he's part of a, a good community. Oh, we are coming up to our break, everyone. Um, don't think I can sit still here, but uh, I'll keep running during the break. And then, uh, yeah, we'll see you guys afterwards. Hopefully, I will... I, I shouldn't be... <laughs> All I'm doing is running, so... I'm gonna try to stay in place, but just in case... Um, I can't, I'll be having to run. And so, if I'm in a different location, when we come back, because... I got ambushed. So. Alright, everybody. See you after the break. 